There's a lot of ways in which you can experience borderline personality disorder, and I think it's amazing that Pete Davidson has been so open about his experience. Borderline personality disorder has four main problem areas. The first is about identity, understanding yourself, who you are. And number two, it's about relationships, a long pattern of difficult relationships. Number three, difficulty managing intense emotions. And number four, sometimes doing things that are impulsive, like self-injury or sometimes substance use. We know borderline personality disorder emerges out of a combination of biology, environment, and experience. Something that he's done that has probably made a lot of difference in a lot of lives is talking openly as a man who has borderline personality disorder. This is a problem that is really underdiagnosed in men. By sharing his story, I think he's made it a lot easier for a lot of other guys to get help for this problem. Something he mentioned on Weekend Update that isn't quite accurate is that borderline personality disorder is a type of depression. Depression is a mood disorder. It's about feeling low, and in the case of bipolar depression, feeling low or feeling high, feeling fast and slow. Borderline personality disorder is a little bit different, and it's this longer pattern of problems. And why that's an important distinction, different treatments work for depression and different treatments work for borderline personality disorder. One of the most effective treatments is dialectical behavior therapy. In this treatment, you learn more about yourself, how you've been experiencing borderline personality disorder, and skills to overcome the problems it produces. For a long time, we didn't have any treatments that work for borderline personality disorder, but we do now. There are a number of effective treatments available and there is help and there's hope. <laughs>